want to try the PR chain. No, I, I remember what it looks like. I don't want to. Uh -oh. oh, fine. Let's try it. Let's try it. The set thing, this thing, but the set. Salmon ch ch cream cheese mango. Yeah. That sounds interesting. Okay. The salmon teriyaki set and the karage set. Chicken karage? Karage. And the karage set. Because Japanese has so many ways to express itself in cooking. There you have your chef who can do like amazing skills. For example, you could flip this and it's landed over here. There's also those chefs who have you know, like those highly flavored meals. There's also the wasabi, there's... Japan has a lot of spices. They also invented sushi. I mean, come on, it's sushi. How can you argue with that? I mean, if Japan can make a black blob of spikes into something edible, then I have to try it. No! Because they just thought, they just told the kid to add something to can and then that kid said shit. So can shit. The wildest guess I've ever made. Umi. Umi, umi. I don't want to eat it. Smell it. Smells nothing. Soy sauce. Smells like soy sauce. And eat. No way I'm gonna eat that yet. Japanese food you what do you say? Thank you in Japanese. Arigato gozaimasu. Arigato gozaim. Wait, how do you how do you do this? Is it like this? How? Look at that! Wow! Look at that! How do you say let's eat in Japanese? Tai in Taiwanito. Crunchy, it's sweet, it's hot, and it definitely tastes like salmon. Good flavor. Wow! It's crunchy, it's hot. Not fatty and juicy. Wait, what should I try in this? How am I supposed to eat this? Oh, come on! It's spicy, it's slippery, and it has a bit of egg taste to it. I can't try this. This is raw salmon. It smells and tastes a little bit like gravy. And other than that, the meat is soft. So is the skin. And it's very tender. And I would rate this. This is definitely a must try. 10 out of 10. Perfect. From the salmon to the pork, everything's just so hot, juicy, and tender. Except this, of course. I mean, how could you make this tender? It's slippery, it has a spice to it. It's just generally nice. And it has the egg taste flowing into the actual soup. Now I'm gonna try a bit of the umi because I'm not sure what in the world this is. It's kinda... It's kinda tasteless, but from what I could... From what I could uh, taste, it's kind of a bit of a 
salty wow. and just a cinch of sour from what I can taste. Wow. That is a delicate, uh, delicate, what, what, what do you call it again? Delicate food? That is a, this is a delicate food. It's crunchy, a bit wet. It tastes like it's wet, but the taste is dry in texture. And it tastes like vegetables. Okay. Next, on to. What is this again? Benny Soga. Sliced on, ginger. On to Benny Soga, a sliced ginger. Uh, since I know what this tastes like, I'm gonna partner this with salmon. Let's just grab this and do it. And a very strong minty smell. Crunchy, but very minty. You should definitely portray this with something else. By doing this solo, it will have a very strong taste. It's like eating a raw onion. I like the pork concoction. This was my second favorite. Because the contact the contact tonkatsu the con the the tonkatsu pork it goes with the thing that's surrounding it. Like in the area around here, it blends with the pork itself. Great. The soup was my third favorite because it was just generally spicy and it goes with the egg. Also hot. The chicken was good, but it wasn't as hot as it could have been. I'll be juicy. It isn't hot, even though it's freshly cooked. I thought that one. The one is my last because I have no idea what that is. Yeah. And it has a tiny t amount of taste. Although the most delicate, I'm not used to it. That's why I'm putting it at the lowest. I recommend this restaurant at SM South Mall in Las Piñas City. The food is good from what I tried and definitely 10 out of 10. I just love the Japanese food and culture and especially about how the lan paper lanterns, sushi and everything is made. Definitely highly recommend. Anyways, thanks for watching. If you want to see more of this, then subscribe and ring the mo notification bell for more videos coming up. See you. Bye. Okay, yay. Now see. Is there an actual fork and spoon?